11th and final race of the afternoon, Jade Sorbet and their scent on their way from that 1,600 metre marker. Very untidy between Ultra Basco and Mage were both very slow into stride and we'll have to race in the back end of the field early on. Smart Racer broke out well enough with Y Mir. In between those, you've got God's Gift, who's also pushing forward to try and be one of the early front runners. Straight and Arrow's trapped on the outside of runners. Then comes Air Boss and the White Salts, who settles on the heels of the leading quartet of runners, just one and a half lengths off the leading group. Up on the outside is Khan Pegasus, followed by a very surprised Balkan races three deep in the White Sleeves blue cap. Kinabalu Lights improved on the inside rail to race six lengths off the gallop. A breakaway of three lengths are running to Pacific Four they've been followed by Mage and last of all is the grey Ultra Bastro as easily as about nine lengths that cover the field as they're into the turn with just on 800 meters left to go now Waimir a narrow leader by just about a head Smart Racer holds his spot on the rail in second traveling well enough at this stage breakaway of three lengths to God's Gift who watches the pace up in front Khan Pegasus is at that one's girth on the outside followed by Balkan then comes Air Boss straight and Arrow Kinabalu light very surprised has got eight lengths to make up and he's on the outside of runners at the top of the straight now with 450 meters left to go at Smart Racer who's trying to make every post a winning one he's still in front why Mir's right there in second God's Gift is absolutely cruising on the outside and God's Gift's now picked up the advantage with 250 meters left to go he's gone clear Khan Pegasus out the pad chasing in second why Mir Smart Racer's run his race then comes further back in the field Air Boss but it's God's Gift now being tackled late by Khan Pegasus Khan Pegasus with God's Gift God's Gift still in front Ultra Basco running on late but God's Gift's gonna get there God's Gift will win it's second and third gets close maybe Ultrabastro up on the outside ahead of Khan Pegasus further back in the field we had Pacific Fortune breakaway of a couple of lengths to Air Boss Kinabalu Light Straits and Arrow Mage then came Y Mir followed by Bolton Smart Racer and very surprised unfortunately nothing happened today number four God's Gift wins well makes it back to back wins for him a very impressive run by Ultra Basco, considering what happened before the start. He's absolutely taken up on the outside to run into that second placing. Third went the way of number five, Khan Pegasus. So we had quite a few late challenges here. God's Gift moved up and hit the front with 400 meters left to go. Might have been a touch too early, but God's Gift kept on rolling. And will win by just over a length. I think Ultra Basco has done enough to get into that second spot ahead of number five. And then we'll wait for confirmation for the minor placings. He had all of Kinabalu Light running on with Air Boss. Unfortunately, Y Mir had run his race, a smart racer, the two pacemakers up in front. And they faded out in the final 100 meters or so. So 4, 5, 10. Fourth went the way of number 13, Air Boss. 4, 10, 5, and 13 is the provision. The sorts of P.S. Lim, a big well done to all the winning connections and takes his win total up now to three wins from the six local starts in Malaysia. Second place going the way of number 10, Ultra Bastro. Absolutely took off up on the outside to run into second placing. Ultra Bastro is still a maiden and has done really well to finish in that second spot. As for the TH Tun owners, Trained by Sheree Kim Hamilton and ridden by R. Nickman. Third went the way of number five. And that was Khan Pegasus from the Ananthan Stable in the Sorts of Zarina, ridden by A.L. De Silva. And fourth going the way of number 13, Air Boss, ridden by S. Ali for the Wayne Lum Stable in the colors of Mot Akram Poshni. A big well done to all of the connections here for the final result. 4, 10, 5, and 13. As we wait for the all clear to come through and for the dividends to be given for the 11th and final race at the Selendor Turf Club.